Today's episode is brought to you by Progressive, where drivers who save by switching save nearly $750 on average. Quote now at Progressive.com. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company and Affiliates. National average 12-month savings of $744 by new customers surveyed who saved with Progressive between June 2022 and May 2023. Potential savings will vary. Thanks for supporting the Fable and Folly Network. Here's another show we know you'll love. Where am I? Welcome to Desert Skies, Traveler. Your journey through the physical plane has come to an end. I am the attendant. My colleague here is the mechanic. Yo. This is your last stop on your way to the great beyond. It's our job to make sure you're prepared for the ride. Now, before hitting the road, we have an impressive selection of over 34 varieties of microwavable burritos. Um, what, what? What's going on? There's got to be a better afterlife than this. I mean, come on! Uh, that's offensive. Something seems to be wrong with me. You left something major undone. I have a life outside of this gas station, you know. You quite literally do not. Any hobbies? Nope. Ever travel? Nope. Love interests? Are you kidding? Oh my god. You're like the human version of a plain bagel. Cash register. How can I help you, attendant? Play some music? You got it. It's kind of funny, though. What I needed wasn't back there. It was here, waiting for me. I wonder what it feels like, Mac, to miss the physical plane, the people you left behind. You know, I had a wife who died three years ago. Wish I could go back. No, you don't need to go back. You just need to be here. And a new traveler approaches. Ready, team? Ready. Good. Let's do this. Find Desert Skies wherever you listen to podcasts. Previously on Our Dumb Universe, Dan, Ken, Pangler, Fuzzo, Sandra, and Blore have made it to the Null Treasure Ship, the location of the Fart Knocker, the fastest craft in the universe. Velma Caval just made a deal to... Really, it's a lot. If this is your first episode, it's... You shouldn't be jumping in here. Uh, go back and start at the beginning. Really? No? Oh, well, fine. What is to be done by you? Listen to this. The next episode, episode 11, Father Knows Best. Dan Kent is mine, and that fart knocker is yours. Behold it, the finest ship in the universe. Behold it. Wow, it makes me wish in my trash. <gasps> it's so beautiful. Poor, poor. There you go. Boom. Interior has this black leather, not sure what kind, probably hydrogen goat. Goat leather? Is that a thing? I'm not really a leather guy. Too much work oiling it. Not worth it. Vinyl is more my... Some rubber. There you go. Come on now, son. Let's teleport back to the purple nothing. Well, I guess this is it. Have fun. I'd say smell you later. But where we're going, you'll be too far to smell ever again. But I'll always remember how you smell. Bad. Thank you, Dan Kent, for for what you're doing. Yeah. Hey, maybe I can visit sometime. I can come up with a scheme and you can try to thwart it, maybe. Or, heck, maybe we can thwart it together. I'd like that, probably. I'll miss you. Goodbye forever. Really Everything. respect the passion, but also it's not about me, so boring. Enjoy the leather. Yes, now, transporting. He's gone. Now let's get the hell out of here. And we're back. Nice. All your front-facing parts still front-facing? I think so. Let me check. Nope. Yep. Huh. Yep. That's new. Yep. Yep. Close enough. I'm good. Perfect. You know, Pops, you're not so bad. I mean, you're a genocidal universe calling madman, but maybe we can toss a ball. And we can bond over nachos. Exactly. I will painfully and mercilessly mold you into an air. 
strip you of your humanity and instill in you object cruelty and the power of positive thinking. Ah, okay, so we're uh, still a bit apart on the details, but in any event, thanks for letting my friends go. <laughs> yeah, it was a great bit, right? Hilarious. You get it. Get it? What, 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 what do I get? The fart knocker. It's super complicated. You'd need, like, a genius AI to get it working. Even we can't figure it out. Wish we could. We'd have been conquering in half the time. But you said... Oh, I gave it to them. Too bad if they can't use it. Technicality. Boom. They could bang the keys for decades and nothing. Well, not really, because my treasury death troops in special battle armor with quark cannon accessory will probably super kill them just about now. You dick! Again, I said I wouldn't kill them. Didn't say my death troopers wouldn't. Details. <laughs> I love them. You're a super dick. Yeah, we don't get to be the Velmok by being chill. I told you, I make the best deals for me. No, for us. You wanted to play catch, right? I think I have a thermal grenade somewhere. You can stuff it. I hate you. Those are my friends. And and you killed Val. She was my She was my best friend. So so nuts to you. Nuts to me? Nuts to me? You listen here, young man. As long as you're under my flagship's roof, you'll kill who I say you kill. You're not my real dad. But just because you sport into space, that don't make you a part of me. My family, my real family is on that ship. You're a null. That's what's real. Not your pathetic human body and feelings. You know it. You've always known it. Feel it deep inside. Inside? Feel? Deep? I feel something, all right. This. I ain't the product of the gook inside my bones. I ain't your babe just cause you sport into the unknown. My null is voided, you're nobody, you don't count. So take a high pops, you ain't even worth an ounce. Wait, wait a minute, what's this coming out my mouth? Never sung nothing before, but now I guess I'm singing out. Well, let me sing, yeah, exactly what I've on my mind. Cause it's been boiling up there for some time. You missed on your long con, so piss off, I ain't your son bum. Take a long walk, off a short dock, you can suck my balls. I voluntarily disinherit me, you as a parent I reject. Already got myself a family and one that doesn't make me sick. I guess Sandra's like my mom and maybe Pangla's my kid sis. Bloor's like a weird uncle and there's Fuzzo too, I guess. Look, I ain't much, but to them I guess I count. So let's hit the chorus and really spell it out. You missed on this long con. So piss off and kiss my chops, pops. Go blast off, you jag off. You can suck my balls. Man, I love singing. Who knew it was so easy? Honestly, it's freaky. Just breathe. Up. You're so bad, my actual dad looks better just because. So take your war crimes and shove them in your bum. This singing detective ain't your son. No, I ain't much, but all I am is not thanks to you. Not that you'd understand what friends can do. No, you missed on this long con. So lift off, get your hot air long gone. I got my friends, you ain't like them. You ain't worth the breath to tell you off. Sad, really. Suck my balls. I don't understand your obsession with me mouthing spheroids. Parenting is dumb. Well, I tried. Time to kill you. Not if I teleport out first. 
My teleporting crystal, but how? But how, indeed. I nabbed it while I was singing. I learned the move from the pickpocket, Pockets Pickens. He and I were having a sort of cat and mouse game, which is when we dress a cat to mouse costume. Whoa, whoa! Watch that. Stop talking so I can slice you up properly. Because I am... <laughs> Ow! My face! You socked it! Sorry, not sorry, jerk. Crystal, take me away! <laughs> But you gotta respect the move. <laughs> really is my son. Too bad I have to kill him. All of them. They're all dead. They can't use the ship. They can't escape. Ready the invasion ships. Who am I talking to? The Fable and Folly Network supports creators of exceptional audio stories, including the one you're listening to right now. If you love our shows, we want to hear from you. Complete our listener survey at fableandfolly.com slash survey. This will help us learn more about you, what you like, what you'd like to hear more of, and how we can maintain an inclusive, safe atmosphere. As a thank you for your participation, we have extras and behind-the-scenes content from your favorite shows. Fans make the network what it is. Thanks for listening, and we can't wait to hear from you. Find our listener survey at fableandfolly.com slash survey today. Looking to get out of the ads and back to the story? Fable and Folly Plus is a new way to support the creators you love. The podcast you're listening to right now and more than 60 others can be heard ad-free for as little as $4 a month by visiting fableandfolly.com slash plus. And now you'll start to see Fable and Folly Network shows are offering bonus content to all existing and new supporters. Find exclusive new episodes from shows like Civilized and Realms of Peril and Glory. Fable and Folly Plus. Sign up today at fableandfolly.com slash plus. Oh, crackers, they're going to be cheesed by the null troops. I hope I'm not too late. Oh, no. It's... Wait. It's the fart knocker. That fart ship is blasting the troops! Oh! Oh, yeah! Oh! That's the last of them. It's blasted them all. How'd they get it working? Oh, well, the door's open. Dan Ken, is that you saying what's happening? Yeah, I punched my dad. Good for you. A real dream come true, beating up dads. Every son dreams of one day giving his pop a punch in the talk hole. Mission accomplished. And really, what is a mission? Get in the park now. Oh. Wow, it's as slick as a rick. The ricks were very slick. Yes, yes, we get it. But how'd you get it started? Old man Null said it was too complicated. We gave it the finger. Indeed. A very particular program-filled finger. Yes, indeed. I'm back, detective. Bracelet, huh? What? No. Me, Professor Y. My USB finger with my Y-grams perfectly integrated my digital consciousness with the fart knocker. But now it's called the Y-ship. Guess who's back? Why is here? New ship, who's here? Nobody of my own 
to call my own so dark and cold Next thing I know, I'm returned to so much more From death last box fresh out and before The white ship is a fly ship Kids a night ship, got a new lease on life ship Ship is priceless, nothing gonna stop her Gonna bother a blocker Back to the top, to the center of the galaxy Hop on, the starship is a hardship Gonna star in the story of a glory Left and ready to the party Three, two, one, blast off and ascend To the ends of the galaxy and do it again uh, uh. The white ship is a fly ship Kids a night ship, got a new lease on life ship what else? This ship is fartacular. Take us away, farty. Why ship? It's why ship because Y is the most uh, spaceship like letter and. We know you named it after yourself. Shut up, you. It's the Y is just. Um, it. <laughs> Lore's right. We don't have time to argue about alphabets from destroyed planets. We need to get out of here. Right, definitely. But unfortunately, because the ship was built for peace, it has no weapons or shields, which is sad. But I have some awesome sensors that are detecting things. Like, the only reason we're alive is that this treasure ship has extremely strong walls and shields. It's like a space brick. But as soon as the fart knocker leaves, we could easily be blasted. Like a glass brick. So we're trapped. Like a prison brick. Sad. But there must be something. Maybe if we form a cuddle portal and see where our bodies take us? Later. Right now, we can't group grope our way out of this. Grope. Bricks. Space. Glass. It's... <gasps> I know what I have to do! Remember what Velmach Kavold said? Holy bofooly, that gets the stabbies out. Yeah, that was weird. Sure, yeah, it was, but that's not what I was thinking of. Instead... The treasure ship, which runs from some simple controls via the cockpit over there, it's so simple, even one of you dummies could fly it. I like that one, too. Also, remember when he said... I'm a big, dumb squish butt. My butt is so big and so full of squish. Squish, squish, squish. <laughs> he definitely said that, guys. Remember? <laughs> Pengla, it's fun to make people say stuff in our mind's eye, but we don't have time for that. We have to save the day. And by we, I mean me. Me, Emperor Fuzzo. You see, I am the chosen one. Not for Earth, not for the tooth or the fuzz, but you. Us. Us, group of losers and weirdos. Hey. He's not wrong. Well, can I at least be a loser? You always have been. Aw, oh, thanks. <laughs> anyway, talking, me, I'm chosen to save you. Ugh. I'll fly the treasure ship right at the purple nothing. Its shields and hull will survive any blast. And as they try to stop me, you all fly away. But you'll be... I know. What? What will you be? A pirate? A witch? A hug? Will you be a hug? Pangla, you're my twin. My sister. And I wish we had more time to get to know each other. To really connect. Our lives were messed up from the jump. And I... I'm sorry. I should have done more. And I should have... I was scared for so long. Scared. I know. How can someone so handsome and so awesome be scared? But I was. I am. But remember, even when I'm gone, I love you so much. So in a way, I will turn into a hug. A hug around you in spirit. Always. No! There has to be another way. My sensors indicate that the Null are boarding raiding ships to invade the treasure ship. Did I mention these sensors are amazing? The ship is really, it's intense. I can see like all sorts of tumors on Dankette's liver and so many colors. I am so powerful. <laughs> um. Brother, Fezzo, we should do your plan. Okay. Also, isn't there something you want to say to me? No, I don't think so. Sorry that you captured and tortured me? Oh, yes, that. Sorry. But you did want to kill me. You sent, like, a bunch of those Y teens after me. True. Well, we both did things we regret. But mostly you. Take care of them, Y ship. Don't tell me what to do! But yes, I will. I love you, bro. 
My fuzz is your fuzz. Fuzzo, away. My awesome Y sensor sense that he's reached the controls. He's starting up. He's. No, 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 he's flooding the engine. Now he's cursing a bit. He. Now he's got it. He's maneuvering the treasure ship. Now he's opening the rear bay doors. As soon as he accelerates the treasure ship toward the purple nothing treasure, we'll spill out the back. When that happens, we spill out with it and use the treasure as cover to fly away. Yeah. Yes, exactly. It all makes perfect sense. Don't think about it too hard. Status on the invasion ships. They're ready to launch in two cloaks, sir. Huh? Oh, wait. Uh, something is happening. Things are always happening. That's the nature of the universe. I meant in a more direct way in regards to our situation, uh, sir. Report. The treasure ship is... It, it's heading towards us. It's locked onto the bridge. So, in layman's terms, it's coming right at us? My words exact. Shut up, layman. Why do we have this guy? Well, since you asked, it's quite the story. I... Layman Laymanson was born. The treasure ship Ooh. is on a collision course. Lock on Omicron torpedoes and laser cannons. It's too close for torpedoes, and our lasers won't pierce its hole because you bought that yttrium sighting for it. Remember? It was such a good deal. Okay, let's work out a solution. What are the pluses and deltas? Give it to me. I'm not sure if there's anything we can do. Huh, that is a power move, really. Okay, oh, here we go. Navigation indicates that you are on a collision course. Death will be swift and probably painful. Shall I divert? For the last time, no! Okay then, I'm out of here. Navigation system escape pod activate. Damn coward computer. Come back and die like me! Die? Wow. Oh. Ooh. It's all really. Ooh. It's. Hmm. This is it. How do you like this, Dad? A lot more than tending to the floss flock. I am more than. I'm. I'm doing it. I am saving people. I'm making a difference. Brushy, I'll see you. Maybe. Let's do this. I've thought of this a thousand times And stayed my hands to stay and stand abuse I've reason now more than before To fight for life, to shut this door My friends, my sister, all the joy in truth Once my father preached a toothy plan he promised greater life for man And in this scope I searched for hope No use Disappointment was my guide I met her then She stayed my life Laughing for she knows more than I do But why now? My soul at peace Her voice is finally gone from me I want to live now Peacefully subdued The sea inside me Free from waves That made me sick For all my days And crushed and shamed And raised my whole life through I changed the world I made Feet of my self doubt. No heaven waits for me if heaven's true. My father's gone, my mom, my throne, the cancers that consumed my soul. I'm free of them, my fate is mine to choose. This 
monsters hug around me I want to know a life that's free of hatred, free of doubting me I want to see I want to make up for the time I've wasted, sad and fearful How do I make up for the pain I've laid on those that care for me I think now I see Onward into the breeze Not alone, you're here with me. We're all together in the end. We stand with you, our crew, our friends. I feel you now. I know what I must do. I know now why my soul's at peace before my death was just for me to save me from some awful aching truth. But now I die, so I may live My friends, they will remember it Because they live, because I got them through The universe is more than me But I am part of it, part of the we I'll die for that, for it Collision imminent, Belmark Gvold. We're all super dead. Ah, well, fascinating. Well. Wow. It's gone. It's all. It's all gone. Gone. We're free to make the jump. Next stop, the Urbrain. Well, in six years, but hope you brought it back. Fuzzo is gone. The null neutralized. Our heroes head to the Urbrain. But it's a long trip. What will they find there? Can they save the Earth? Find out next time on the series finale of The Fall of the House of Sunshine, Our Dumb Universe, Episode 12, The Brain at the End of the Universe. The Fall of the House of Sunshine is a Roy Gold production. It was written by Jonathan Goldberg with music by Matt Roy Berger. Learn more about the show and cast at podmusical.com. Last call for questions or comments for our big end of series Q&A episode. Always wanted to know what Fuzzo smelled like or who Dan Kent's favorite Dan Kent is? Who would win in a fight? The intern or advisor? The question possibilities are question endless. Question us! And make sure to like, rate, subscribe, and most of all, have a suntabulous bicuspid of a day. Also, the intern would win. Suck my balls. The Fable and Folly Network, where fiction producers flourish.